Hey guys, welcome back to the Mentor Me series. My name is Dave Nixon, and today we're going to continue on with the Coaching Commandments, which is Coaching Commandment number eight, Outcome Focused. Now, what this is really referring to is making sure that as a coach or a trainer, when working with an individual, we are continually focused on the outcome. Now, if think of another way to break that down is to think, what is to come out of this person's training? Now, we can often get lost and go, well, they're trying to get a bit heavier squat, or they're trying to get stronger, or they're trying to get fitter, or they're trying to lose weight. And you can probably take it for the superficial, like the first level and go, okay, fair enough. Well, we can set up some training for that. Or you could probably go a little bit further and go, well, what what is really to come out of that? Like, why are they wanting to do that? Because what we need to remember is that our approach to each individual's outcome needs to be different, even if it's a very similar outcome. And we need to understand that the motivation behind the behavior is also going to be very different. Some people want to lose weight because they want to prove someone wrong, whereas some people want to lose weight because the doctor told them that if they don't lose weight, that they're not going to have children. Then someone else wants to lose weight because they've always been overweight, which is another problem in itself. And so you've got to think about what is the actual motivation behind their behavior or maybe the behavior they desire to do, which is leading to an outcome because what's to come out of it for them? Not for you as the trainer or coach. That's not what it's about. It's making sure that we're looking at it and going, okay, what is the actual outcome? Because if we can really define what that is, we can be focused on that and we can keep what's important top of mind. And it goes back to the other coaching commandment, which is keeping the long game in mind. A lot of people, if we go back to the weight loss example, probably just want to lose weight so they can play with their children and be a good example in that realm. And if that's the case, then that's the conversation we need to have with our clients more often than talking about food and just talking about how to lose weight and just throwing technical solutions at them. Technical solutions won't solve behavioral issues. And so it's important that we're able to meet our outcomes on that level and then train them and coach them from there. So team, coaching commitment number eight, outcome focused. Make sure you're able to get to the outcome with your client first and build a relationship to be able to really peel that away over time. And from there, that's where all of your direction and training should go. Yeah, and your conversations. Cool. Until next time, peace and pizza. I'll see you guys soon.